people and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a grocery haul. I know the last time I made a video it was also a grocery haul, um, but we are in the process of packing and moving and time to film has not been a top priority and I'm sorry, but I know you guys like my grocery haul, so I had to film my grocery haul for this week. So this is going to be a bigger grocery haul and I did go to two different grocery stores. So I did my normal Walmart pickup and then I also had to go back to a local grocery store and pick up some things that Walmart was out of. And I don't know if this is going on in you guys' area, but are you guys out of stuff again? Because when I did my Walmart pickup, the the um, young man who put my groceries in my car for me said that they're starting to like have a lot of stuff out of stock, which freaks me out because we all know how that was a few months ago and I'm not looking forward to doing that again. So anyway, I'm gonna show you guys what I picked up. If you are new, my name is Andrea and make sure you hit that subscribe button before you leave and let's go ahead and jump into the haul. The first thing that I picked up was some of the Simply Watermelon Juice. We love watermelons and we love watermelon juice in our household, so I grabbed some of that. I also grabbed some of my dairy-free creamer. Um, I am not 100% dairy-free, but I do try to do dairy-free creamer because coffee is hard enough on your tummy as it is, and dairy is also hard on your tummy, I think, in general as it is. So, I try to just do dairy-free as much as possible. Obviously, I love cheese, so that is one thing I'm just not willing to, like, buckle on, but I picked up that. I used to like the oat milk creamer, but it is, like, impossible to find, so I get the almond milk creamer instead. Um, I also picked up two of these cream cheeses. So I got the chive and onion and the honey pecan. So that is for dipping or for bagels. Speaking of bagels, I got some of these, what are these called? The Dave's Killer Bread Plain Awesome Bagels. So this is the first time picking these up. But I think this will be a new staple in our house because Manny and I both love... Get down! Anyway, Manny and I both love bagels and these have 11 grams of protein and they're 5 super grains and no high fructose corn, fruit toast corn syrup, syrup meh, um, which is crazy. Do the other ones have corn syrup in them? I don't know. I'm not like a crazy person about that, but I try to steer clear of it as like much as I possibly can. Um, I also picked up two of these almond milk um, yogurts. So I got the vanilla and the dark chocolate coconut. I've had this one before and it is so delicious. It is definitely one of my favorites. I also picked up Manny some of this organic, why do I always say organic? Um, Stony Phil Organic Probiotic Yogurt and the Whole Milk Vanilla. He loves this yogurt and also a staple in our home. I also grabbed some pickles. I originally ordered the halves, but they gave me the sandwich slices, which is fine. I also grabbed some of this on the border cantina salsa, self-explanatory. Um, I picked up Matt and I one of these Snapple apples. He already drank his, so this is mine. We used to drink these so much when we were dating. Um, it was just like this little thing. We would always pick each other up a Snapple apple and then in the lid, it has like a cute little saying. And so we would always like read each other's little lids or whatever. <laughs> I know it sounds silly, but that's what we did. So I also picked up a yellow onion and a red onion for some recipes this week. I also picked up these um, broccoli fries. Manny absolutely freaking loves these. I actually picked up four bags. I only have two showing here. Um, but these are really hard to find and Walmart didn't have these. So I knew I was going to have to go into another grocery store anyway. So I just went ahead and like kind of stocked up on these because I know he'll eat these. And if this is the only vegetable he gets, then so be it. Because um, I know he'll eat them. He's not a huge fan of vegetables, which, which most toddlers are not I feel like so I do put these in the air fryer just because I feel like it's a little bit healthier and he loves them I also grabbed him some of these 
power waffles. These are the blueberry. The reason I love these so much is because they have a lot of protein and they're not filled with a bunch of like junky ingredients. Um, Manny does not like eggs. He doesn't like a lot of stuff. I feel like that's very normal for toddlers his age. I mean, he does eat a lot of stuff that's surprising like General Tso's chicken and oh, there's like fruit flies. Um, and things like that, like random stuff like that. But I'm always looking for ways to get extra protein in his diet. Um, I also picked up some thin sliced chicken breast. The chicken that I normally get um, is not thin sliced, but the last time I picked it up, the chicken breasts were like this thick and that just grosses me out and freaks me out. So I decided to go with a different brand this week. And because obviously I had to pick up my meat at a different grocery store. So they had a different brand. I think they do carry the brand that I normally get the harvest, whatever. Um, but I ended up getting this one. I also got some ground Turkey, which is, we always get that. And then I got a big pack of, um, hamburger meat. So it's three pounds yeah, 3.12 pounds um, of hamburger meat because we, I'm going to be making some recipes this week that need hamburger meat. And I normally get the organic grass fed, but they didn't have it. So that's what I got. Next, I got this caramel cream um, Walmart brand K cup. They didn't have the brand that I normally like, so I just got that. I also got just the donut shop because um, Matt prefers like the plain coffee. I like the flavor, uh, but I can drink the plain, so it's not a big deal. I also got some of these caramel rice cakes for snacks. I got some of this <laughs> Jet Puffed Marshmallow Cream. This is gonna be for Manny for a little treat, occasionally, you know. Got some bananas. I also got these Nature Path Organic Strawberry Toaster pastries or pop tarts. Um, Manny loves pop tarts, but I just don't like to give him the regular pop tarts. So we like to get the organic ones. I also got some of these RX Bar Kids um, strawberry protein snack bars. I haven't seen these before, but I figured Manny would love them. And any little thing, like I said, to get in some protein. Um, I got these so healthy, I know, but. Manny will not eat tacos, but he will eat these taco shells. So, got to pick your battles sometimes. Organic here, processed there, whatever. <laughs> um, I also got three of these ready rice. I love these. Like, I know they're probably not the best because you stick them in the microwave. I mean, it does say BPA-free pouch. So, um, but I just like to throw these in the microwave for a quick side for dinner. I also grabbed some of these flour tortillas. Finally, they had one of the brands that I like. Um, so I grabbed these for salad wraps, quesadillas, burritos, tacos, whatever. Um, got some ketchup. They were out of the Hunt's Organic. So I got, um, substituted the Great Value brand, which is fine. I also got some of these petite diced tomatoes for a recipe. And my can is dented, which is kind of annoying, but um, I got some of this, what is this called? Honey Bunches of Oats, Granola, and the Toffee Almond Flavor. That is going to be for snacking and for yogurt. I got some ranch croutons for my salad because I've been craving croutons for my salads and I haven't had them in quite some time. I got a couple of these pears. What are these called? These are gaucho pears. I don't think that's what they're called. I don't know, but they're pears. <laughs> they have a special name, but I forget. I also got a can of tomato puree for a recipe. I got some of these tortillas, um, tortilla chips. I've never seen these before, but they look really like crispy and light, which I prefer. Uh, it says thin and crispy. Um, I'm excited to try those. I also got some of this pasta salad. I, I normally, I normally get the suddenly salad pasta brand, but I love Hidden Valley Ranch. So I decided to give this one a try and see how it goes. Okay. So up next, I grabbed this Hello Bella.
Mello um, shampoo and body wash in the watermelon scent. I have some water. This is so funny. I have some watermelon body wash that I just picked up for myself and I saw this and I was like, yeah, he's a boy, whatever. He's, ha he's gonna smell like a watermelon, like his mama. Um, and then I also grabbed this, um, the same, pretty much the same brand, the same thing in the fresh and clean scent, just in case he does have a reaction, um, cause he does have very sensitive skin. So stuff bothers him sometimes. And then I grabbed some of this magic razorless shave cream. Um, I've never tried this before. Let me know in the comments down below if you've ever tried this before. I saw the shave powder trending on TikTok not too long ago, and I wanted to give it a try because everyone swears by it. This is a different product because they don't seem to ever carry the powder anymore, so I got the, the cream. So we'll see how it goes, but wish me luck on that. And last but certainly not least, I got a plethora of these stirs. So I got some of the strawberry watermelon, the fruit punch, um, strawberry watermelon, fruit punch. And then my new favorite is this black cherry. So it looks like that. Is it going to focus? Can you focus? Yes or no? Anyway, it really, it tastes like cheer wine to me, which I guess if you don't live in the Carolinas, well, I don't know. I don't know how far it goes. When I lived in Virginia, it was really hard to find, but I did find it in like one gas station. Um, but cheer wine is made in the Carolinas and it tastes like cheer wine just without the fizz. So if you like cheer wine, definitely try that. And then I got the um, vitamin B12, the vitamin B Mio as well. So that is my grocery haul for this. Oh wait, I just, just kidding. And I also got some bacon. Oh, and then a couple of things that I did pick up that we actually ate already are um, this orange chicken, this PF Chains orange chicken and this um, vegetable fried rice. Both of these are very good. And we had them for dinner last night. It reminds me a lot of the Trader Joe's orange chicken and fried rice. I actually like the fried rice better, I think. Anyway, so thank you guys so much for watching this video today. I hope you guys enjoyed this grocery haul. As always, I will put the total down here on the bottom so you can see how much I spent. And thank you guys so much for hanging out and for watching today. I hope you guys enjoyed this grocery haul. Um, if you did, make sure you give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you have not already. And thanks for being my kind of weird. Bye.